An Idaho Falls man who killed his fiance and buried her body in the basement of their home will spend 45 years in prison, 15 years fixed, 30 years indeterminate based on a variety of factors. Jeremy White appeared stone faced and had nothing to say during the sentencing hearing Wednesday morning with Judge Bruce Pickett. But Kristen Caldwell's family members packed the courtroom. They were crying and at one point Kristen's sister took the stand and said, quote, I do not forgive you and I will not forgive you. I hate you more than I have hated anyone or anything in my life. I hope prison is horrible for you. I hope it's the stuff nightmares are made of and I hope when judgment day comes you rot in hell. Kristen's daughter also gave a victim's impact statement and said people tell me it will get easier every day but so far it hasn't. Now both White and the Bonneville County Prosecutor's Office entered a plea agreement in July agreeing to a 45 year prison sentence. Although White had nothing to say, his attorney made a few comments. Not once did he try to disparage Christine's uh, memory. Not once did he shirk responsibility. Not once did he try to make himself look like a victim or explain away what had happened or provide with me an excuse. Bonneville County Prosecuting Attorney Danny Clark said no sentence will make this case right. And this is a case that's about choices. With the choices he made, he also removed choices from the victim and her family. We've got sisters who don't grow old together with Kristen. We have children who uh, grow into maturehood, adulthood without their mother. We have grandchildren um, who either won't ever know or won't know long enough their grandmother. Judge Pickett called this quote a horrific crime with bizarre behavior and wondered why White didn't just walk away instead of strangling his fiance. You were having an affair with someone else. Uh, and as I thought through why you didn't leave and why this crime occurred, I think that you gotten used to her taking care of you and that she was a good person you liked the relation the situation you were in and you were hesitant hesitant to leave that however you also wanted to not have any obligations white was also ordered to pay a ten thousand dollar fine and a no contact order with several members of Kristen caldwell's family remains in effect until september 20th 2062. Reporting at the Bonneville County Courthouse, I'm Nate Eaton, eastidahonews.com.